Hi there! Have you ever been wondering how people get their fire caps so easily? How they collect that huge amount of money? How they level up so quickly how only a bot could do? And how they get the equipment you can only dream of? Well, this video has all the answers! As you might already have guessed, there are indeed hidden cheats in RuneScape, which make your life so much easier. I have done a lot of research, and here are some of the most useful cheats in the game. Enjoy and have fun with achieving anything in no time! Let's start with one of the most famous cheats. The fight caves are a tough challenge, fighting through hundreds of monsters and finally facing a level 702 monster. To succeed easily, you should try this invincibility cheat. Hit up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right, down, yes, no, no, yes, and bow. And for the rest of your attempt, you are invincible. Judge without any problems and finally claim your point. Next up, there's an infamous cheat using a strange glitch. In preparation, put the item you want to duplicate in your fixed inventory slot. I'll demonstrate it with some deadly cabbages. And make sure you have a teleport to Karamja with you. Start in Lumbridge and talk to the range tutor. Ask her about who she is, go through the text and end the conversation. Next up, teleport to Karamja. This is where the actual cheat takes place. Start walking up and down on the coastline until a monster appears. This might take a while and if you are unlucky, you might encounter something else first, but eventually a wild signal will appear. It is advised that you escape from this battle, as it is very tough to beat and killing it can have a strange effect on your account. Either way, after the battle, take a look at your inventory and you'll have 129 of the items you wanted to duplicate. Congratulations! Now I want to show you a simple little cheat, which can be nice if you get annoyed by people. All you have to do for this one is to type CPKTNWT and explode the severely damaged war players around you. If you want to discover a secret area in RuneScape the Treasure Island, this cheat is for you. There are several conditions to meet here. In your inventory you'll need some coins which are a multiple of 11, also cabbages in a multiple of 11, leather boots and finally Bronx in battle access also a multiple of 11. Also make sure that the sum of those three is around 42k. If you meet those conditions use the Falador teleport. You will find yourself on the secret treasure island where you can do absolutely nothing. It's completely useless and no one ever comes there. Well, there are some exceptions of course. Where's Bellows? How did you even get here? Filthy cheater. Okay. No. Next up I discovered the intername cheat. As you know you usually start the game as a useless level 3. However, if you start the game with the right name, things can change. This is especially useful if something goes wrong with your main account. Here are some examples. I can has whip. Start the game with a whip equipped. Adult linked. Start the game with a Master Sword. Andrew starts the game with an inventory full of cabbages. Zyma starts the game with all maxed out stats. Another secret area to discover is the Miner's World. You probably already noticed the pipe in the Lumbridge Starter Dungeon. If you try around a little, you will eventually get past the invisible barrier and reach the pipe. Jump into it and gaze at the hidden Miner's World. Just remember, there's nothing to do here except for repeating the same level again and again and there's no way to get out. I also have a cheat for you if you get into trouble in a dungeon. To be able to walk through walls, type in IDCLIP. Using this cheat, you can escape from dungeons if you get annoyed. However, don't forget that all dungeons in Moonscape are linked to each other. Last but not least, there's another item duplicate cheat. You will need a friend to trade with you for this one. Offer the item you want to duplicate and have your friend offer an item that you can go without. When the trade window is in the final stage, quickly close your runescape window. Your friend will complete the trade whereas you keep your initial item. So afterwards both of you have a duplicated item. So that's it for now, I hope you found some of the cheats useful and you will use them wisely. If there are more great cheats you know about, why not let everybody know and post it in a comment. Take care, good thanks, bye.